Why do you fear? Welcome all of you to this video in the name of Jesus. The enemy of Christians is the devil. Devil is the enemy of Jesus Christ. Satan is the enemy of God. Also, he is the enemy of the people who follow Jesus Christ and true living God of the world. And this Satan may create situations for the Christians and he will make the people to fear the situations, surroundings, circumstances in their life. He will create the enemy, Satan will create difficulties, sufferings, problems. He will bring all inconveniences, situations which are bad to the followers of Christ in the world. He wants to destroy the faith of the Christians, the faith they had kept in their mind on Jesus Christ. The Satan wants to destroy the faith, the people who kept in their hearts towards Jesus Christ. To destroy this faith, to break the faith of the Christians, Satan will bring all unwanted activities, all the problems to the Christians in the world. And the Christians may see there is no any way to live in the world because of many problems, sufferings, bad situations in the life. It is the trick of the Satan to create such a type of situations to the Christians to break the faith they had kept in their mind towards living God of the world and divert their attention towards the living God and bring them from their faith to outside, outside of their faith. Bring them outside of their faith. Destroy their faith. Break their faith is the main aim and motto of the devil who is there in the world. So Christians must be, be careful. All the Christians must be careful. The children of God must be careful. There will be problems, sufferings, difficulties, financial tides, financial difficulties. Satan will bring all such type of things to the people who follow true living God of the world. So you should not leave your faith. You must be firm in your faith whatever happens whatever happens in the world for you. For this purpose, I have chosen one word from the Bible. We can see the word from the Bible now. Isaiah 41, chapter 41, verse 10. What does it say? So do not fear, for I am with you. Do not be dismayed, for I am your God. I will strengthen you and help you. I will uphold you with my righteous right hand. What does the word say? This is taken from the book of Isaiah, chapter 41, verse 10. So do not fear, for I am with you. Do not be dismayed, for I am your God. I will strengthen you and help you. I will uphold you with my righteous right hand. God says to you, child of God, don't fear. Don't fear anything of this world. And he says, I am with you. God is there with you. You don't want to worry. You don't want to fear. Do not be dismayed. Do not be discouraged. Don't want to leave your courage. Be strong. Be courageous. 
for i am your god god says to you child of god god says to you i am your god i will strengthen you and i will help you <coughs> god says i am your god i will strengthen you i will help you don't fear for i am with you i am with you god says i am with you oh child of god god says i am with you you don't want to worry you don't want to fear god says to you don't fear satan will bring all the things to make you weak to leave your faith and destroy your faith and break your faith satan will create all the unwanted situations for you in the world jesus said once i have overcome the world jesus said once i have overcome the world satan tested him many times even though satan tested him jesus overcame all the situations of the world so you don't want to worry you don't want to fear any situations which are facing you which are coming to your life in the world and again god says i will strengthen you i will give you strength i will help you god says i will help you this is not a human being says to you this is this is telling god says to you not human being says to you remember that god says to you not a human being says like this to you i will strengthen you and will help you i will uphold you he will lift you up with his righteous right hand god will lift you in your life with his righteous right hand don't fear it is the trick of the satan to bring all unwanted situations in your life to make your faith weak to divert your attention towards jesus christ in the world to divert divert your you from the faith which you have which you have kept in your mind towards jesus christ in the world satan will bring he will use all the tricks to do to destroy your faith to divert your attention from jesus christ he will bring all financial difficulties troubles problems sufferings bad bad situations in your life to divert your faith to destroy your faith to break your faith that is the trick of the satan of this world satan is the ruler of this world he will do everything be careful do not be do not be afraid do not fear god is with you do not be discouraged do not be dismayed i he god says i am with you god says i am with you not human being says like this god says i am with you mighty living god says i am with you why are you fearing who who will do what no man can do anything against you no devil can do any no devil can do anything against you don't worry be courageous be strong face all the situations overcome all the situations in the life don't worry don't fear why do you fear <coughs> 